To find the IP address of your printer, touch on the blue wireless LED icon. Take note of this IP address. You can even print details if needed. Once you know the IP address of your printer, go to your Chromebook and open up the Google Chrome browser. Key in the IP address. This will bring up the embedded web server of the HP OfficeJet Pro 8730. Go to Scan. It is saying that the scan the computer or web scan has been disabled. In order to enable that, go to Settings. Under Settings, go to Security and select Administrator Settings. It's going to redirect you to a secure page. It is saying that your connection is not private. Go to Advance and proceed to the IP address of your printer. Over here, you will see that all the administrator settings for this printer there's connectivity, network settings, web services settings, as well as printer settings, among other settings. Scroll down until you see Scan, and there is an option for Web Scan from Embedded Web Server or EWS. You need to check that box. Once it's done, click on Apply. The settings have been updated successfully. Next, you may want to go back to Scan. This is a scan interface of the EWS. We're going to scan multiple pages. So let's select the document source as ADF. Do take note that the document source for either glass or ADF is dependent on your printer, some of which comes with an ADF, some of which does not. You'll notice that the document type is automatically grayed out because it knows that if you're scanning from the ADF, it has to be a PDF document. We will leave the rest of the settings as is, because it is what our documents are, which is one-sided and is A4 in paper size. Load the document into the ADF as shown. and click on Start Scan. It's starting the web scan. The four-page document has been scanned. In order to save the document, do a right click and you can have a save as. Let's save it to my drive. 
and we will name the document as test. So you are actually looking at your safe document right now. Let's go back to the EWS. So do take note that whatever settings that you are seeing here is what the printer is capable of. Even whether the document is one-sided or two-sided original. That is totally dependent on your printer, whether it supports or whether it has that function. So this is how you scan multiple pages using your Chromebook on the uh, embedded web server web scan. I hope this is helpful and useful to some of you. Thank you.